Welcome back to Ta-da! 3D Printing. Chapter 4, Electronics Assembly. Difficulty, moderate, only six steps. Okay. Find the slot for the nylon filament on the Incy base. You will need it in the next step. Yes, okay, I do see it. It's over here. Okay. We need to twist the textile sleeve. This will prevent the cables from slipping during the printing. Twist the sleeve, not the cables, and create several wraps. Okay, now I made it too small, so I might need to untwist it a little bit. I liked how snug it seemed, but yeah, I guess that's going to be about right. Slide the nylon filament in the hole. Yeah, okay. It is in there. Make sure it's not pushing on the motor. No, it's good. Slide the sleeve in the holder at least three quarters of the holder's height. Yeah, I think that's good. I feel like I'm overlapped enough. Okay, you can see. Looks like it's overlapped a decent amount. Not all the way, but it's good. Okay, so now we're going to put the cable clip back. Try to snug this around as much as possible on this side. Okay, let's see if we can get these screws to attach. Just attached, they're not doing great, they're not super snug. Okay, I think that is good as it's gonna be now i need to reattach a pinda okay it goes in the same place of course so it's gonna be all the way on the right from the top the first one that's large so it's technically the third slot Pretty sure it goes this direction, yeah. Okay. Definitely could do some cable management here. Looks like everything could go. So really the only thing that I can do, as far as all this mess, is tuck some of these up here. How the heck I'm supposed to get these zip ties in? I have no idea. Hmm. These zip ties do not want to go in this opening at all. So I've got one up along the top here, and it does not want to go in. Hmm. I might not be zip tying everything in, I might just be setting it as good as I can get it. But it's not going to be snapping on anything. Okay. 
Yeah, it's not ideal. I don't know if there's smaller zip ties somewhere else. Maybe so, maybe it came with smaller zip ties. Hmm, okay. Well, I'm just gonna be careful as I'm closing this so that I don't hit anything. And step six, it's done. Close the ENC door and secure it with the M3 by 40 screw. You're almost done. So we're almost done if we're upgrading the entire thing. I'm not gonna do the Y axis upgrade. So I'm just gonna move on to the pre-flight check. Let me know your thoughts. If you think I missed anything, thanks for watching.